The Boston Celtics have trade exceptions that are expiring soon, with the biggest one being worth nearly $6 million and expiring on Thursday, which is the trade deadline. The Celtics cleared a roster spot last month by trading Noah Vonla to the Spurs, and they plan to be aggressive in acquiring a player with the biggest trade exception before it expires. They could either make a big deal with substantial salaries or young talent, or acquire a player with the trade exception by trading draft capital. The Celtics have potential second-round picks in 2023, first-round picks in 2025, 2027, and 2029, and some players on the roster that can be traded. They could look at acquiring players such as Cam Reddish, P.J. Washington, Jalen Smith, and Sadik Bay among others, with the trade exception or through trades. But first, if you are new to the Celtics News Channel, take advantage and subscribe so you don't miss the latest news that happens in the world of basketball. We are always bringing you first hand here, enjoy and like this video, so that YouTube continues to bring you the latest Celtics news in the world of basketball. In conclusion, the Boston Celtics have the potential to make a takeover in the next trade deal period, using their highest value trade exception of approximately $6 million. They have some trade assets including first-round picks in 2025, 2027 and 2029, and second-round picks in 2023. Some players that could be targeted include P.J. Washington, Torrey Craig, Jard Vanderbilt and Sadik Bay. However, the cost of acquiring these players could be high, which will determine whether or not the Celtics should move forward with a trade.